Today we will analyze the performance of a sales team using Google's Looker Studio. Looker Studio is a data visualization and business intelligence tool that allows users to create interactive dashboards, reports, and other data-driven insights. We will use a Google Sheet as a source data, which has already been placed in the Google Drive. To create a new dashboard in the Looker Studio, click on Blank Report. Now click on the Google Sheets, as source data. Select the file you want to add to the data source. Then select the sheet that contains the data. You can change the page size from the page settings. We have a wider monitor, therefore we will select a wider resolution, with lower height. Select and delete the table created by Looker Studio. Insert a text box, to add a title to the dashboard. From View menu select Snap to the Grid option. Select the grid size from the same menu. These settings will help you design the dashboard, more precisely and accurately. Add a title to the text box. Change the force size, to make the title prominent. Change the border color to black. Insert a date control to the dashboard, to filter the data by period. Place the date control at the top of the dashboard. Change the border color of the date control to black. Now, we will add a calculated field to our data source. We will add the field name cost, which will be calculated by deducting the profit from sales. After creating the field, press save and then press done. The cost field is now added to the data source. Insert a scorecard to the dashboard. Change the metric to sales. Create another scorecard. Change the border colors of the scorecard to black. In the second scorecard, change the metric to cost. Create another scorecard for profit. Change the metric from cost to profit. Add a combo chart to the dashboard. Sales and cost have automatically been selected. Change the cost metric to profit. Replace the salesman with the month field in the dimension.
Move one of the axes to the right. Move the profit field above the sales field. Change the border color to black. Let's select a specific date range from the date control. Sort the chart by dates. Add a column chart to the dashboard. Change the charge type, to the stacked column chart. Add the profit and cost to the metric area. Add the month field to the dimension area. Change the border color to black. Add the manager field to the dashboard. Add the salesman to the dimensions as well. Add the category field to the dashboard. Change the border color to black. Add the product field to the dimensions as well. Add a pie chart to the dashboard. Change the pie chart metric, from profit to sales. Change the border color to black. Make a copy of the pie chart, and place it below the existing pie chart. Change the dimension from salesman, to product category.
Our dashboard is now complete, let's switch from editing to view. Thanks for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe for more tutorials and updates.